Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today, I will show you some methods to fix error code NW314682 on PS4. Method 1. Restart the PlayStation 4 system and the router. We need to turn off the PlayStation and the router. After that, unplug their power cable. Wait from 5 to 10 minutes. After that, replug the power cable and restart the PlayStation and the router. At last, check to see if this helps you or not. Method 2. Move the PlayStation closer to the router and use wired connection. If you are using a wired connection with an Ethernet cable, please skip this method. So, try move the PlayStation closer to the router. After that, if the issue persists then use a wired connection with an Ethernet cable. Try test internet connection and see the problem is fixed. Method 3. Change DNS. Go to settings. Go to network. Go to set up internet connection, then select the Wi-Fi or LAN cable option depending on how you connect. Here, I'm using the Wi-Fi connect. Next, select the custom option. Select a Wi-Fi network to utilize if required, and enter the password for it. Choose the automatic option for IP address settings. Select the do not specify DHCP setting. Choose the manual DNS setting. Here, I will try with Cloudflare DNS. Type 1.1.1.1 as the primary DNS. Type 1.0.0.1 for the secondary DNS. Additionally, you can also try with other DNS such as Google DNS, OpenDNS, etc. Now select Next. Select Automatic. Select Do not use options to finish. Method 4. Try on another network or router. If you have more than one router, try replacing the router you are using with another router. We do this to eliminate the possibility that the problem is caused by the router's strict security features. If that's not possible, try connecting to another wireless network, such as a neighbor's wireless network, mobile data, 4G, 5G, etc. Method 5. Restoring default settings. Go to Settings. Then scroll down to bottom. Now, select initialization. Select restore default settings. Then you'll have to enter in this specific code. So just enter 0000. At this time, the system will display a notification panel. The following settings will be restored to default values. So, restoring default settings won't delete content on console storage such as games, apps, screenshots, video clips, and saved data. Select Restore then wait for the PS4 system to reboot. Method 6. Factory reset the PS4 and the router. This is the final method we can do now. To do that on the router. First, Make sure keep your router plugged in. Find your router's reset button. This will be on the back or the bottom of your router. Use a paperclip or similar object to hold down the reset button for 30 seconds. Release the button. Wait for the router to power back on. To factory reset the PS4, go to settings. 
Go to Initialization option at the bottom. Choose Initialize PS4. Choose Full option. Select Initialize. Confirm with the Yes option. Wait for some time to finish the process. Finally, the system might not have obtained an IP address, or the DNS settings may have been changed. Please contact your internet service provider for further assistance. That's it guys, hope this is helpful. If you have any further questions, please feel free to get in touch or leave a comment. Thanks.